Much of our knowledge for fish as food comes from marine sources or large scale commercial fisheries in the Great Lakes or something like that. But the ways in which um, individual people interact with fish and fisheries is really on these kind of small scale inland fisheries, whether that's recreational or subsistence fisheries. I'm Holly Emke. I'm a research fish biologist with the Midwest Climate Adaptation Science Center, and I'm based out of Madison, Wisconsin. Most of my research is focused on understanding conditions to support inland fish communities in a changing climate. So that work happens in partnership with local communities of use, whether that's uh, tribal communities or angling communities. And much of that work happens across a range of scales from the local, so for example, walleye and Wisconsin lakes to the more regional, understanding tribal perspectives on lake sturgeon. The inland fisheries of kind of the upper Midwest are really interesting to me because they're all multi-species fisheries. So when we think about the management and climate adaptation approaches that we use for them, it's difficult to just think about managing for one species because when we manage for one species like walleye, the interactions with the other species really play a role. And so understanding how we can support these fish communities to be the most resilient they can be in this changing climate. To be able to then um, support the needs of these multiple users groups is really kind of an exciting complex problem that I'm interested in, in solving in the most um, sustainable way. Inland fisheries provide a, a really important source of food and where I think just starting to understand that contribution.